right downtown in the foothills of the Rockies, Denver, Colorado. Scene of NHL action featuring the team linked to those mountains, the Avalanche. Everybody, along with Eddie Olchek, Mike Emmerich here. You like pitching battles in baseball? We might be seeing one of those tonight because these are two strong defensive teams. Well, I agree with you, Doc, 100%, and it might be the first one-to-one one will win this game here. Just thinking out loud, Doc, both of these teams make very few mistakes. It is probably going to come down to a missed assignment or possibly a power play here or there that makes the difference in this game. What up, everybody? It is Ron, and welcome back. NHL 15. B A G M slash G M mode going up against the New York Rangers. A little backup goalie action. Rito Barra probably going to get up against. Yes, indeedy. The King. Henrik Lundqvist should be a challenge. Our backup goalie going up against one of the best goalies, if not the best goalie in the league. And holy crap. Now, I am, in case you guys don't know, I am a Rangers fan. And I have friends, like, being from New Jersey, I have friends that are Devils fans. And I have friends that are Rangers fans. And I know how, you know, in all sports, for every team, there are fans that are stupid. Let's say. And my best friend's brother, who is also a Rangers fan, is one of those stupid fans. Because he thinks Lundqvist is not just not the best. He thinks he sucks. <laughs> like, he's one of the people who's like, oh, well, uh, Cam Talbot was uh, the Rangers starter. They would have won the Stanley Cup. They, they wouldn't have even lost. And every time he talks with things like that, I want to cry, and I want to hurt people, and oh, what a friggin' play by Zooks. That was upsetting. But it's just like, what? What? It just doesn't make sense. Why would you think a backup goalie? Now, I like Cam Talbot. He's not bad. He's pretty good, but just no. Just, just flat out no. There was no way the Rangers would win the Stanley Cup with Cam Talbot as their starter. There's no way the Rangers would have even made it to the Stanley Cup without uh, or with Cam Talbot. It was my one buddy, the uh, the best friend who is not the stupid brother. Goes, I wonder how far we would have, like, I wonder where the Rangers would be if. Lundqvist wasn't our goalie. So my response was, oh, hey, remember the Stanley Cup Finals? Yeah, we wouldn't have been there. Remember the uh, series against Montreal and Pittsburgh and Philly? Yeah, we wouldn't have won them. And it's like, you know the playoffs? Yeah, we wouldn't have been in them. It's like, he's kind of good. In case you didn't notice. However, I'm not making him look good because I have, like, one shot maybe. And by the time this video goes up, the season would have started. And I don't know if... I don't know because I don't know the exact date that I'm going to be putting this video up. But I'm recording this one week prior to the Rangers home opener, which I think today is the 5th? It's a Sunday. And yeah, it's the 5th. And I am... Desperately trying to find reasonably priced tickets to the Rangers home opener. Because I've never been to a home opener. And it's banner night even though, you know, it's second place banner. But it's still banner night. Which is kind of cool. And I just want to go. Because I'm super excited for hockey season. And I want to go. And there are no cheap tickets. So, depending on when this episode goes up, I'm either still looking for tickets, got tickets, or didn't get tickets because the price has never dropped. From damn secondary markets. 
Now, I use an app called uh, SeatGeek. I don't know if you guys have that app, but it uh, it basically just takes all the prices from like everywhere, whether it be like StubHub or like NHL slash NHL ticket exchange, you know, depending on what sport you're looking for. Uh, some random other ones that I didn't even know were websites. And you know, just gives it, gives uh, all of them. And, you know, so you don't have to go through 15 different websites to try and find tickets. It's just right there. It's a blams. Which is nice. However, they're not showing me good prices. Which means people are not selling them for good prices. There was one pair of tickets that I saw earlier in the week. So about a week and a half before the actual game. And it was... Almost center ice between First blue line and center ice, like the third level, second level. It was, I think it's the 200s if you know MSG. If not, you can look up my map if you're that curious. But not the highest level, but not, you know, you're not low, but, you know, good height. And I like being higher for hockey because you can see more. And it was uh, 98 a piece. And I... I so I'm so mad I didn't like jump that. on him. Down so here, mad. Because those would have been ring. perfect. At 100 bucks a pop. The on the but nope, off. they were within like 10 minutes of me seeing them. They were swiped. And uh, then like 5 minutes after that, they were being resold for 150 a pop. Because some that person is just a scumbag. Alright, so now I have to focus on this game because I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm facing the Rangers and I have a breakaway. And I have a stop. Oh! No! What the freak is going on? St. Louis, stop it. Damn it. Long pass from to step up. Back in his defensive end to get him. Come on. Oh, baby. Another one. No, McDonald's got wheels. Oh, God. Step on the Hurt Man. The Hurt Man. A face off win. Let's see what develops. Dumped into the opposite corner by Dan Girardi. The apps will start from their own end. Oh, baby. Okay. Friggin' Dan Girardi. Oh, boy. Oh, offside. Dan Girardi. Offside. Nine minutes have been played. Neither goalie has made any mistakes. Dan Gerard, the man that I think should be the captain. At this point, it has not been announced who the captain will be. I honestly think it will be McDonough. However, I don't think it should be. So we'll see if I'm right. I think it's going to be McDonough, and so does everyone else in the world, but... I just don't think... I'd rather it be uh, Girardi. I mean, everyone knows the real captain's Lundqvist anyway, but... From defense to offense. Perfect receipt of the pass. Yep. JT, oh, JT Miller getting stuffed. Laid up that right side to Landisgaard. In the attacking zone. Yeah, take that, Kevin Klein. You forgot about Langdy. Great save there. Not much room to work, but he got a good shot away. Uh, with this puck being so close to that, this is all a reactionary save. Heads to the front. Yo! Did you imagine Cody McLeod gets the goal against Lundqvist on a backhand? Skate, Cody! You can beat him! You can beat him up! I didn't finish my sentence. Whoopsies! Oh, what? what? Again? Are you serious? Back to back puck. Dude, get out of my way, Lundqvist. Oh god. Pass. 
<gasps> Does that freaking Marty have it? What? The freak? Picks up that pass. What's next? Cut on by with that one. The cursed goals are the ones in the last minute. minute and the last. Will we see one here? Outlet it to Brassard. To Kreider. To Kreider. Shook through great. In the slot. Oh, God. Outstanding Woo. stop. They don't ask how. He just did. Yo. Yeah. Nice. This. Yeah. Let the clock end. 40 minutes played. 20 minutes to go. Nothing to save it for now. Alrighty, final period. Unless we go to OT. Has been superb, but no goals have been scored. Gets in, looks over his options here. Scooped up by McDonough. Slid to Nash. Guided through center for Stepan. Into the end of attack. Hammers one. Nope. Let's right go here. The go to there. Watch. He's got that one. Get by McDonough. Nash. Not happening. Wrist shot. Ooh, what a break. Shot hit the man. He showed us a lot on that one. Oh, Boom, baby. I saw that play coming from a mile away. Oh, crap. Right on his score. Friggin' Rick Nash. Thought the goalies were going to be perfect. They were till now. Just a hair under four minutes. Friggin' Rick Nash. In the third. Only one goal hanging on the board so far. So it's one nothing. Rick Nash assisted by number 26, Martin Singh. To Ennis. By number 21. Pass ahead through center for O'Reilly. Three minutes. Moved along and in. Ah. Grabbed off by Zuccarello. Takes it behind his own cage. To Brassard. Propelled to That is Havlat. What the freak is he doing on this team? On to center ice. He can start some danger here. And that one's routine. Didn't he sign with uh covered whistle blown? Barry's what was it? Gets him into position the Devils? Deliver a crushing hit. Does that mean the Rangers and the Devils did a trade? Is that the what just happened here? Clean win on the, draw. the Avs will start from their own end. It's a three on two. How will they defend this? What a save by Lundquist. Oh, that was a reactionary save. Oh slot. boy. That's a good Man, Haglin and Kreider on the same no line. That, puck going in his stick. that is speed, 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 speed. And then Dominic Moore, which just to the well, what a glove save. isn't the best sentiment Intrusive for them, but. I mean, I like Dominic Moore, but I mean. Kreider is much better than a, center, than a player who should be with Dominic Moore. To glass. Oh god. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. Parked it. Save. Okay. Moves up along. Klaus got this. Laid on to glass. Little pass that can start some progress ahead. The app shift from on. defense nice. to offense. Wires one up the gut to Mitchell. Perfect centering pass. Oh! Yeah, turn around. Go it. Great save point point. Keep shooting. Ah, oh, penalty. Dive! It was a dive! Minor penalty. Two minutes. And the call is tripping. The Rangers power play gets another chance to operate. And there, up here. Let's skate. And Boyle can't stop me. Aglin can't stop me. Parked at the crease. He's through. Oh, we went in! <laughs> Luke City! Oh, baby, oh, baby. Not gonna like this one. The fluke! Oh, off McDonough's stick. He went for the poke check. Oh, wait, I might have hit both of them. I don't know who the other player was, but McDonough's stick was there. Another player's stick was there. I don't know which one it hit, but I'll take it. 
The Rangers coaching staff needs to get them refocused. They have been tied, and it's late. Elevator to Nash. Short-handed by number 90, Ryan. Oh, it's very important if he can get that out. Give me that. Oh, they got freaking. Thank you. Penalty shot. No hesitation at all, Doc, by the official to make the penalty shot call on the trip from behind on the attacking player on the breakaway. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, oh, baby, oh, baby. This is big. This is big. Oh, that was dirty. Oh, my goodness. I gotta do stuff like that more often. Look at that. I was about to say, why doesn't it say two? So that was the second goal. Play him out. Oh, are you serious? For what? Boarding? Oh, this is big. I got two short-handed goals. Does that? Yeah, that's it. Kind of sure. What the freak? How? Broussard's quick wrist shot surprised the goaltender in close. And so I don't know about you from up there, but I thought he stopped this. It's just ricocheted off him into the net. Oh my goodness. The Rangers got that faceoff win. Gets on by. In the slot, he's got it. Oh, that's right. They're still on the power play. I forgot we took another one. Stays on side to the middle. Gets by. He missed the net. Oh, what a missed opportunity to take the lead. Not going to get a better chance. Go in. And that was Damn just it. a bit outside. The Rangers' power play will reset. To Moore. To Broussard. Broussard's got the hot hand on the power play. He's got one so far. Good centering pass to the slot. Get the Tyler. Or not. Chip to Zuccarello. Angled to Moore. Drives to the crease. Yeah, just hold it. Just hold it. The apps with a face off win. Oh, what? Back in front. He wow. But the post. He's right in front with it. Right from the slot. Picked up in the attacking zone by McDonough. The Avs PK was big at the biggest time. The oh my god. Oh my god. Just freaking hold him. That's all I want you to do. Outstanding save. Difficult opportunity. You want to score goals, you have to go to this area. I see. Okay. Find a way to put okay. It and it is icing on this play. Oh my. It'll come right back in their end for a critical face off. The Rangers get the draw. Big drive. Good block. Good block. Gains the zone. Accidentally blocked. Goalies will take that one. On to step up. Got it on his stick at the slot. Wow, that was freaking ridiculous. He covers and a face off will follow. Rangers win that face off. Oh my god. Outstanding save. What magic even to get there and get the shot off. Looks ahead to start something. To more. Okay, so this has been a struggle. So let's just play for overtime. Unless nope, didn't know didn't have time. Didn't have the time. The game is knotted up as we're headed to overtime. No, I'm pretty dangerous in overtime. I'm just saying. If no one scores here, we'll go to the slot. A shot. 
Moved to the shadow of the boards by Gabriel Landeskog. Oh, here's a wrister. Paddled aside. Glides across. Oh, God. No, oh, thanks, St. Louis, for Taking screwing that up. The blue line. Gets across, looks over his options. Lifted on goal. Oh. The goalies there. Geometrically to St. Louis. Oh, there's Carries that line again. A river from the point. Near the boards. Shoots one. Good attempt. Easy save. Back behind while players change. McDonough's cut through the neutral zone. Onside. Heads on to the corner. Right in nope. front. No soup for you, Broussard. Out in front. Fires. Oh, what a stop. That's an unbelievable stop. Oh, crap. Colorado's guilty. It is done for the night. Conduct. And the shower head is sprinkling. The Avs have a fairly average record in the shootout, guys. They haven't had any continuity in the players that they use offensively. As a result, they don't Woo! have any go-to guy. Send over here. He's got it, but has to get rid of it. Slid to Mitchell. Right up the side. To there go. And then we'll right send her down. Can he get it out? We'll out play it smart. Play for the shootout. So on this power play, they will resume from their own the end of the ice. In the Nash is carrying it through center. Oh, he made him zig when he should have zagged, didn't he? Oh, good chance here. He kicked away. Last minute of play in the overtime. Will there be a shootout ahead, or could we get I sure freaking hope so, Doc. Down. I sure hope so. You know what? Just play it smart. They must retreat for line change. And start back again to San Luis. No shadow of the boards here. Moves it to the barrier at center ice. Given back to San Luis. Takes that was a it up failed attempt, boards. but good try, buddy. Picks it up in his own end to step on. Carries it up the wing. Puck picked up in the neutral zone by O'Reilly. And he is close. Okay, John Moore. I see how it is. The physical play in this game has really picked up, and there's a perfect example of that. Nice move to shake. And there we go. To the shootout. I like it a lot. Survived the, uh, I guess you can say five minute power play. Wasn't exactly a five minute power play, well, but I'll, you know, I'll still repaired. take it. The coaches have submitted their lists. Of, he turns it away. There was Good job, buddy. Here is the first answer in the shootout. Oh! It is tied after Bummer. Who puts on the he got his glove on that one. We haven't had a goal yet. Will we have one here? He makes the save on a disappointing shot. Try going to Snipe City. Come on, Barra. Oh, he just got burned. Now, can Lane do repeat what he did earlier in the game? Nope. Not by Lundquist. All right, we got a point, though. So all is not lost. All right, guys, that is where we end this episode. Thank you very much for watching. I sure hope you enjoyed. Remember to leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe if you guys want to see more. Peace.